Hey there, Officer Scorpio, and welcome now to Wednesday, and happy Lycast Day to you. What's Lycast Day? Well, put simply, this is the day where the sun and moon conjunct. They come in orbit together. It looks like they're on top of each other against the constellation this month of Taurus. This is basically the new moon. It's a conjunction. And going all the way back to pagan times, this is a very spiritual and potent moment for the universe. It's the rebirth of the moon, and it symbolizes the birth of new ideas and of manifesting reality and moving forward in reality. So today is the day to manifest, and for Scorpios, you're really kind of highly attuned to long-term relationship growth. In the last three weeks, basically, as the sun has transited your opposite sign, Taurus, it's been about a reevaluation of long-term relationships. How are they working for you? Are people showing up for you as much as you're showing up for them? Or what do you have to face in yourself to connect deeper with people and align yourself strategically, whether it's romantic, business, or friendship? Today is a day where really, if you haven't drawn in the right relationships or you're really trying to inspire existing ones to elevate to higher planes, this is a good day to put your wishes out to the universe in the form of light casting or visualization. It's simple. Just consciously think for a few minutes about what you envision and put your heart, your love, and your desire behind that. Poof, that's prayer, that's life ca light casting. That, according to The Secret, is how you manifest reality. And today I'm telling you, very potent when it comes to long-term relationship manifestation. Now, one other thing I want to point out that's going on today behind the scenes, Mars is offline for a day, which kind of gives us a little bit of freedom or any anxiety or pushing, and it's between two houses for you. It's been in the house of creativity, so you've been very fertile the last four and a half weeks, really moving forward with creative plans and creative expansion. Well, now that it moves into the sixth house, it's going to mean it's time to invest in your body, and your daily reality needs to take off, and you might even have some business changes or move or changes of location of your business as Mars transits that house for the next four and a half weeks. All right, that's all we got for the Scorpios. Happy Lightcast Day. See you tomorrow with more Soul Horoscopes. Live, love, be. Soul Garden.